Okay? Well, to start out with, I have questions. I want to know here who designs websites. We have, okay, we have a few. Uh, have you done them in 48 hours? I know you have. Has anyone else done a website? Good, great. Well, now I'm going to tell all of you how you can stretch yourself and do a website in 48 hours. Uh, you can all do it at summer camp. This is what I did last year at the um, Cleveland Gift Camp. Cleveland Gift Camp is a fabulous opportunity. Yes, it is sleepless. You are sleepless in Cleveland. <coughs> you, you start on a Friday night. You meet your team. And then you go about creating uh, a website. But it's not just any website. It's for a nonprofit. Here we are. Uh, here's all 200 of us. And we volunteer to help 20 nonprofits have a working website by Sunday at 5 p.m. So we have dinner. And after dinner, we get together. Well, I was psyched. I was like a kid in school. And I was ready. I had my post-it notes. I had my batteries. I was ready to go. And then we introduce ourselves about, what do you do? Project manager, what do you do? I'm IT. I'm a programmer. Uh, I'm a retired designer. Oh, <coughs> re retired? Uh, tired? You know, that's a bad word. You're tired, and not only were you tired once, but you're retired again. Well, I'm not that old lady. <laughs> I am not tired. And I was very eager to be part of this team and to create something wonderful. And so we started working. And what I did was what my mother did. You rolled up your sleeves. My mother was Rosie the Riveter. And she knew the value of work and positive and doing things. And so as a team, we coalesced. And that is the most important thing, is coalescing at a team, bringing your, your, your talents and everything. This is Erin Clark, amazing young woman. She is a nurse. And this, she founded the foundation. It's a 501c3. And these are kids. It's uh, love in neglected communities. First, they thought it was Cleveland. It's in Kenya. So we begin. What we do is what they call wireframing. I've learned a lot of words. Uh, MVP, minimal viable project. That's what you get done in that short period of time, that you are going to have a very working website. <clears throat> OK. <laughs> we spend all night. <laughs> I work with the IT guys. We have a WordPress that we're going to be doing. And there's project managing going on. And there we are. We had photos Saturday morning. That's our schedule. And if you don't know something, there's a class for you to take it. And you're right. It's, it's code, it's coffee, and it's a lot of food. OK, so here we, we had our plan. What happens Saturday around 10 o'clock? The marketing manager comes in, a very sweet young thing who knew nothing. All she wanted to do was change things. It's like, what are you, an art director? Well, <laughs> I set her straight. Day quickly became night. And man, you do get a little tired here. Uh, but there was more to the day. And we were told to be up on deck at the lean dog. And they were going to have fireworks for us. <laughs> it was beautiful fireworks. But I have to say, when my partner, Alex, the IT guy, said, you know, I make mead. Would you like some? Well, it made Sunday morning a little more difficult, because now we're in crunch time. It's Sunday, and we've got to finish this site. It's got to work. And so you run around. You actually grab people from other teams. This was an illustrator. He was delighted. He worked in freehand. <laughs> but he made it work. And here we are. Crunch time is over. We now are ready for our presentation. It's a little bit like, you know, drum roll type of thing. So everyone sits after all this hubbub of activity, and we get ready to show our site. This is love in neglected communities, and it's all about kids. It's about education, sanitation, nutrition. And by building this site, we made it visible, empathetic, and we had people look at it to donate money. That illustration, that was the freehand. That's interactive. You press on it, we could talk about clean water. You press on the book, it was education. And we all did it within 48 hours. And I want to show you my team. Here we are. There's Aaron and Alex and Tyler and uh, Aaron, our client, the marketing director, and then I'm in the center. It was a phenomenal experience. I will never forget it. 
And what's really delightful I want to share with you is a note I received from, from Erin <coughs> this month. She said that the Aswazi School is going to be finished this year. I mean, I still get goosebumps. So if you have a chance, Cleveland Gift Camp is for you. <laughs>